All right, this is Martin Reeves. The Colorado kid was a world champion in slalom skateboarding, which was all good in the daytime, but not so much after dark. So Martin decided to uh, do something about it. The mechanical engineer invented something called Skate Ray, and he's hoping to make it big in the business of boarding. The now is Kristen Scovera is with me now. And Kristen, uh, Martin hopes to shed some light on this whole situation and make it a whole lot safer for uh, skateboarders as well. Absolutely, and not a moment too soon. The other night I was driving home from work. I almost hit a long border in my car. It was completely dark, but hopefully this clever new invention will help keep skateboarders safe as they ride around town. I'm Martin Reeves, and I ride longboards. But really, I ride this thing pretty much everywhere I go. Martin is not alone. Many riders say they love skating even after the sun goes down. I love to skate at night. All the time. So, you know, you always have to be extra careful because there's um, lots of cars out there. Right now, the sun is shining here at the Denver Skate Park, but in a couple of hours, that will change. And I talked to some of the riders who say they will try to bring their boards home, but will cars be able to see them in the dark? It said walk, and I started to skate across, and a car almost hit me. Skateboarders don't wear reflective anything reflective. I know I don't. It's a safety problem the 23-year-old mechanical engineer decided to shine some light on, and he's doing it in the form of the Skate Ray. It's a waterproof LED light that attaches to the front of a skateboard or longboard, illuminating the darkness so skaters can ride all night long. The Skate Ray fits nice and snug between the board and the trucks. Just like the meat in a skateboard sandwich. I spoke to the inventor via Skype. He's launched a Kickstarter campaign online to fund his bright idea. People are using skateboards and longboards for transportation. They're you know, going to work or their job or school. They're coming home after the sunset, which maybe, you know, they didn't always plan. And so they're, uh, they're at risk. And what about those potholes, rocks, or gaping cracks in the road? Martin says with his skate ray, riders can breathe easier and ride smoother, seeing all the obstacles in their path. Hey, that makes sense, Kristen, because you wouldn't ride a bike or anything else without a reflector or a light on it at night, right? Absolutely not. And so, yeah, it's a wonderful idea. The light kind of shines like this in a V 30 to 40 feet ahead. It's very bright. Wow. It's very effective. Um, head to Kickstarter if you think it's a good idea and you want to contribute. He needs $65,000. Right. He's at 12,000. He has a week, so he needs to get some supporters right. to rally behind this idea. But I think with so many skateboarders, longboarders, maybe the community could get together and help him out. Yeah. Did yeah. you ever skateboard? Uh, snowboard. Snowboard. No. <laughs> yeah, well, I have kids and they, they ride bikes like after dark. And they haven't gotten on skateboards yet, but who knows? But yeah, yeah, as I said, I mean, same thing with a bike or any other activity after dark. You need a light. So hopefully this will work and hopefully Martin will get his money and uh, it'll work for him. Here's hoping. Yeah. All right, Kristen, thanks so much.